for many, many years, um, Canisius College has, has uh, preached a message of uh, respect, compassion, and understanding for all members of the Canisius community. When I came to Canisius, I knew that I wanted to be involved in the LGBT community. I knew that I needed to come out. And I was actually not aware of the extent that the LGBT community was welcome at Canisius. And when I came here and when I saw the Unity Club Room, when I saw the extremely advertised Unity meetings, I just, I was kind of blown away because I didn't know Jesuit institutions were allowed to be that open. Canisius is actually a lot more accepting of LGBTQ plus students than most other Jesuit schools. Um, I went to the Ignatian Q conference last year and I got to talk to other executive board members of GSAs at um, Jesuit schools and they don't even have club status at some schools. Here on our campus uh, we've got a long history with Unity and even before that uh, the Sexuality Programming Committee of tending to our LGBT brothers and sisters. And he was asked rather uh, provocatively if he approved of homosexuality and he here's, what, here's his reply. He said, tell me, when God looks at a gay person, does God affectionately approve of this person's existence? That's, does God affectionately approve of this person's existence? Or does God reject the person with condemnation? Whether we're talking about the uh, LGBTQT community, or we're talking about um, a Muslim community, or we're talking about any other group that you can imagine, we want, a, we want a community here at the college that's based on respect, compassion, and understanding for everyone, regardless of their status or their label or, or anything.